guys welcome back to our channel today I'm going to share with you guys some of the life hacks mom hacks whatever you want to call them that I use around the house on a daily basis all the time one of the first ones that I do that a lot of people have probably seen is wrapping a plastic bag or something around the top of your bananas because they last longer these, I mean, this, they're at the perfect stage right now for me. They taste amazing this way. But they've, I've had these for a week now. I think it's been about a week and they're just now slowly falling off. But I'm getting ready to cut them up anyways, so it's not a big deal. But yeah, I just wrap it around there. You put like a rubber band or something. You could put like a rubber band or something. But this is just like one of the bags that you get from the... Uh, produce aisle anyways so I take a poem in it and then I take it home and wrap it in there sometimes I will put them in the fridge too because they will last a little bit longer in the fridge my first one that I do okay so another life hack that I use if you have a bread it's hard to do when you first open the bread and you only take like a slice or two out it's hard to do it that way but whenever you're done with it of course get your air out twist it a little bit take it fold it put the bread inside there so it's just kind of turned into the bag you got twisted and comes unraveled or anything no it's just like that all right another hack that I do all the time if you don't have any hack clips what I do I take it and cut it kind of like a V So it's like kind of like that and then you don't have a bag clip you take it and just tie it and tying it like that it will not come undone or anything so it stays tied you don't have to double tie it or anything another hack i've actually been using for the past few times and it has helped Make sure you put like a paper towel or something what? in with your salad. Put a paper towel on top of it. And it, it keeps it from getting nasty in there and just moist and everything. So it keeps it from getting wilted and stuff a lot faster. Cause that's one thing I hate about salad. It goes bad very quickly. So this does help me cause I'm the only one who needs a salad. So it doesn't get ate fast enough. Another life hack I use, which was just in one of my recent videos, um, if you have a picture frame that doesn't have, for one, like these are like little canvas that we had, and they didn't have anything to hang up on the wall with, sticky tack didn't work, so my mom gave me this idea, because she was doing it on her things, so I started doing it with my stuff. You can see on the back of this before, I tried using sticky tack on the wall. Doesn't work and it leaves spots on your walls, of course, especially with the blue one. This is just twine, a bunch of twine that's rolled up. I've had this for years and I still have a bunch of it. But, and if you have a hot glue gun, they're real cheap. Um, just get you some twine, cut to where you want it, glue it on there, and it holds perfectly holds really good and of course just hang it on your wall see I have it have all of those hung up with that I have that big board up there with that on it I even have this picture frame right here on it and this one's very this is a pretty heavy picture see it only has the spot just to be you know set up on the table but I put that on there and then hangs up there perfectly it holds really well really strong okay I don't know if you would call this a hack but I do it this way because I don't like the box being up here but for your laundry stuff I had two of these I've, when I first had my first child I used one for the actual wipes and this one I use for dryer sheets <laughs> just pull them out like a like a wipe and they don't like keep coming out like wipes, but still, I I kind of I really like them in there like this. 
So I think it's a, I don't know if you want to call it a hack, but that's my hack. This is my favorite mom hack that I came up with myself a few weeks ago. I get the Kroger uh, pre-made pizza crust. These are going to make, um, this stuff's going to make homemade pizza Lunchables because my oldest one loves them. Um, get these and it comes in a two pack. Um, I tried to do like cute shapes and stuff, but it they're too thick to do that. So you just cut it with a knife into like pizza slices or whatever you want to do. Alright guys, here's slices for him right now. And as you can see, it made a bunch of them. And these last him for quite a while. And I just put them, the extra ones in a baggie. Just put them in the fridge. And you got a bunch of got a bunch of them that will last you for a while. Let's get you a little bit of pizza some I told my sister about this hack too and she thought it was genius. She told me I need to do one of these videos and I have to have this in it because she said it's such a smart thing to do. Just put whatever cheese. He usually just does cheese pizza, but today he wanted pepperoni for some reason, so let's put maybe two on there. That's yes, her Lunchable. Homemade. Usually get like the Capri Suns too, just like you do in like the bigger Lunchables. And boom, you got your much cheaper homemade Lunchables.